Hello and welcome, I'm Marumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's play some more of our After the End mod with Lincoln and, uh, yeah, the Rastafarian Raiders. So, he's coming. And by he, I mean we, because we are we are now Lincoln. Awesome. 24 martial score. We are a badass. 14, 24, 10, 11, 7. Pretty freaking good. Our wife's a bit uh, past childbearing age, so we got to get rid of her. Uh, we've got to claim... No, we don't. We lost the claim. That's right, because we died. Crap. That is the army of Kokel. 933 troops. Well, I guess we're not going to worry about them, that then, are we? Crap. That really kind of threw a kink in my plans. Well, let's go find... Uh, let's go over here and loot. We haven't done this in a little while. These guys are, you know, easy pickings, of course. We'll actually loot from this province so we can see more. There are rumors of a foreign merchant shipwreck off the coast of Isla de la Bahia. According to the tale, the wrecked ship is from a distant land far across the ocean. Survivors can join my court. No survivors means I get to keep the, the salvage. Oh, they can join our court. Our father... Has a legacy to be upheld. So this levy is going to be pretty sick. If we can just, you know, get it to recover. Our capital now has a levy of 2,000 troops. I'm assuming that put us in charge, right? Yes. And with 24 martial score now, 11 progress against a, a fort. Yeah, I think that we can afford to wait 120 days for each one of these sieges. I think it's just well worth it. It's quite a few troops that he's got there. Looks like he may have murked up, possibly. They have no levy, or no, no morale, rather. Diosa has eloped. Who the hell's Diosa? Are you actually coming to, to this spot? You have no morale. Sure, I'll fight you. You have no morale, dude. You're gonna immediately go into the pursuit phase and I'm not gonna take any damage. Do you not know how this game works? Thirty-four percent. Nice. We're down to three, three, uh, three tick sieges now. Very cool. Put it back to here. Lost nineteen men. It's fine. I don't really mind being in combat. You know, if something bad happens to Lincoln. Oh well. Something bad needed to happen to Lincoln. We've only been doing this see this loot for. I'm not even sure how long we've had the troops raised, but we're almost full up. It's a sizable army that he's he's got there. They're starting to get a little bit annoyed with me, I've noticed. Okay, we were headed up this way, and then we got our claim. I still feel like, okay, we might not need the the levy. Sorry, the uh, the mercs. If we're gonna... We're gonna play as, as Lincoln here. Lincoln might be able to raise enough troops on his own. We'll just need to sit around for a couple years and let the levy recover. Which is not really that appealing. Ugh. Once again, he's protecting himself. We'll keep going to the hot spots. We know where to find good money now. Especially these two provinces. Especially this province with the double city. Love that one. But this one's even easier because it's got such a weak castle. Weak, uh, weak town. 200 troops. Two ticks. One, two. Now we're starting to capture prisoners. Actually, there's a pretty good chance we've had these prisoners for a while. I just don't have the pop-ups on for when we capture prisoners.
entirely possible. Yeah, you're not gonna respond to this. This is this is some serious piracy here. Oh god, it's so good. How long is this? I wanna like. I wish we could see when the the ships had departed. Do we wanna become charitable? Yeah, sure. Pretty good chance of it. Oh, we we didn't get it. Once again, we're destroying trade posts. Okay, we're not full yet. I feel like we've done some some damage here. There's just so much more to be had here. Yeah, we're gonna stick to this one. If we're gonna if we're gonna burn something down, I'd rather expose three easy targets versus exposing one. So. Oh, our character still needs to go on a vision quest. Let's let's do that. We see stuff on our vision quest. I communed with the ancestors. And I became more stewardy. Or we could try to take a get an idea. I would love to get di diligent or patient or temperate, so. Nice. We get temperate. Pretty good. So we gained stewardship and we gained two more stewardship. It's not martial score, but it's it's good. It's acceptable. Only 60 ducats remaining available. I think we're going to have to move on after we finish this castle. Wonderful technology stolen. So we have 400 ducats in the bank and 400 ducats on the boats. And we have a crazy huge levy. I think we can win a holy war now. Foreign merchants have anchored their ships. Given your dynasty's established partnership with other foreign merchants, they expect you will allow them to do so. I will say yes, and they may say some, some people. Keep on doing that, that's fine. We have a higher domain limit now as well, because Lincoln's awesome. Guilds of masons and carpenters and caymen are petitioning you for, for you to repeal the current building codes. The codes were put into place after the in the aftermath of the earthquake, but the guild representatives claims that the codes are onerous and costly. No, safety comes first. Uh. Uh. My uncle needs a new wife. Um. Well, you know what? I need a new wife, for crying out loud. Um, sorry, woman. I'll take this one. And my heir can marry... A... Woman? <laughs> he can marry a woman. That's right. Marry Denise. The money that we got from the marriage offset the money we had to pay for the, the divorce. How convenient. Okay, our extra martial score also increases the number of boats we can raise. No, actually, never mind, it doesn't. My mistake. It's it's tempting here to start try to build some of these other buildings, but need shipbuilding to be at level 3. Might not be a bad idea to do that soon. Okay, so if we were to go to war right now, we could raise about... We've got 400 hired. So about 5,000 troops. We've got 800 ducats in the bank, so we could hire probably two merc companies pretty easily. For another... How many? If we hired these ones, we'd be looking at like a second... Like another 5,000 troops. So we could potentially have 10,000 troops. I think that that's more than enough to conquer anything that's going on down here. And what what is going on? When did this get fractured? 
I think, unless I'm mistaken, I decided I wanted Puente Grande as my my capital area. We were going to make this duchy into our capital duchy. Just can't seem to get any damn claims. All right, you are Cult of Saints. Gracia Divina. Yeah. You'll be defended. Cartagena is the most likely person to cause issues. If we just wait a while, we could have another thousand troops. Let's see. Which which levy is it that needs to replenish? Well, that's that's where most of it is. It's like 600 troops here, and that one's going to take forever because of the new administration. So, no, I think we go now. I think we declare now. Let's go ahead. I'm gonna. We're gonna see what happens. He actually has two provinces. Let's go for Ocal instead. We'll see. We're gonna try to do it without Mercs to begin with. Quite enough. Every army doesn't have quite enough boats now. Shoot. Okay, well, we'll stand these guys down. These boats don't need to be raised yet either. Once we get down there, we'll we'll come in. See how many people have honored the call. We got one so far. Between our pretty strong army and the fact that we've got our siege leader, I'm hopeful. Nice, we've been getting a lot of technology recently. We'll come into Gunayala. They are really joining here. We've got quite a few people. Cartagena did join. Being bastards. Alright, we're gonna go ahead, we're gonna hire some mercs. Let's raise the rest of these troops. March here. Let's wait till we have full morale. Also, let's make sure we have our leaders in charge. So we'll lead the center. We've got, uh... I mean, am I... I'm pretty good at leading this side, right? Street movement speed's good. Ah, we need to be in the center for the movement speed. When did we get so good at the movement speed? I didn't even... Oh, our character picked up Organizer at some point. Okay. Yeah, let's go back. We're gonna pick up some mercs. Let's hire them now so that they have full morale by the time we get there. We'll hire... Uh, you don't... I don't know what your combat modifiers are. You got some RAL damage. Major there. There's so many to choose from that... I like that guy. The Captain Yax of the Stonewall Warriors. How are you? Wilbur? No. Basil. Oh. Finley was kind of okay. Let's go for Finley. So that's 51. Do we have 51 boats? We don't have 51 boats. We need more boats. That's 5,000 more troops we're going to bring down here. And I think that if we smash armies before they can convene, it will be okay. He's trying to leave. Let's let him leave. Well. He'll be gone on the 28th. We'll be there on the 2nd. That's actually ideal. They're going to let me clip part of the army. Nope. They're both leaving. Okay, good. Let's just raise more troops here. Okay, and that also gives us time to combine these troops down. This war is going to be a bit costly. We're losing uh, 40 ducats a month, so we can sustain our war for about 10 months. That's it. We've got jungle terrain, so defender bonus. July 20th, July 22nd. Are you actually, like, where are you marching to? I and mean, I'll try to siege this down, sure. 15%, wow. That's some serious siege speed. Okay. 
We're 10,000 now. We've got 22% on a castle. Due to not being in a friendly port. Um, I think you're confused. We have a trade post here, that's why. Trade post up here, too. Cartagena's being all trade posty. Let's take the war goal first. Yeah, they got about 10,000 troops on their own. Two ticks to take the city. And actually that puts us at 100%. <laughs> so... Just offer peace then. Just take it. I mean, there's nothing else that can be taken here, so... I'll hand that out to a random person. We will stand down our personal... Uh, army. Keep the mercs up for the moment since we hired them. Stand down the boats, assuming there's no loss. There shouldn't be. Okay, we have no truce here. Let's, um... Oh, that sucks. Doesn't have the character modifier recent Holy War? What? Five year cooldown on Holy Wars? Is that vanilla? Man, I hired those mercs for nothing. We probably didn't need them. Damn. I had no idea there was a cooldown on that. That's crap. Well, we're not over our, our uh, domain limit, but... we got lots of stuff that needs to, needs to be upgraded. It's going to need a castle town. It's going to give us boats on this side. Now we can consider raiding down here. Not be much that we can actually do. We, we owe it to Cartagena to raid them again. We have too many. We need to raise our, our vessels, levies. Just to have the navy sufficient to carry the whole army. A good problem to have. I say though, sometimes it's a little bit tedious. Control the navies. Well, I mean, the Holy War went well. <laughs> you can't really complain. I mean, I can. No, I don't want to die. I'm too young to die. I'm 37. I'm too good. Oh, that scared me. Sister's dead. Whatever. I don't care about that woman. I only care about myself. Thank you. Cause them some damage. Are we in charge? We are. Good. Two, two tick sieges. Nice. We can get there on the 9th. Versus going this way, we can get there on the 6th. I think it's probably about the same. I don't really care. I accept your gift. Thank you for the hunt- the- the- the dog. Excellent. Heck, I'll take a three- three- uh, three tick siege, that's fine. Stupid merchant republics. You guys deserve it, you know. Oh, successfully delayed my siege by twelve days. Okay, um, another town here. Let's come over here and move this way. Sucre. A new realm, Emperor Bembe. Has decided to abandon the nomadic life and settle down. For him. Okay, so something I want to try. That was pretty quick loot, right? Burning things down is, is definitely a good way to go. But let's see, how many discrete armies can we create that are above 500? 
1800 is the smallest that that one can go. That's pretty good. We get five armies. So now, one thing we could do here is we could start to employ... Like, it's a little bit annoying when they have retinue, but we could start doing coastal raids, like, operating. So what you do is you, you tell them all to go here, go here, here. There's an army there, so we ignore that province. Oh, uh, wait. There, 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 there. And you just deploy the other army just in case for security. But we just show up like this. And then we wait until we see the red little thing. This is another pretty acceptable way to raid. It's better when you have the strength to just like raid everything down. And certainly with our siege guy, we're probably going to continue to want to burn holdings down like the cities. But like that was, I don't know, what, maybe one month and we just got 70 gold. You want to find are provinces that have lots of sea, sea, uh, like lots of sea tiles that have lots of provinces on them. And the great thing is that when you immediately deploy like this, wow, sister's back. When you immediately deploy like this, like they, uh, they don't even usually raise their levy because you have so many of their provinces being sieged that they just give up. They're like, well, I'm not going to raise my levy if you're here. Now they raise because I'm starting to leave. But like, hey, of course we'll pay for that. Okay, so last time we got 70 gold. This time we got, eh, about 65. Not bad. We got one, two, three that we could do here. A bit weak. Head over here and try this one. If it's, I mean, it's not, I wouldn't say that it's really faster. I think we care more about economic technology. It's certainly a little bit more um, intensive. As far as effort goes. And there's certain, there's also provinces that you, you really can't get anything from. So... I think we're not going to do this. Not while we have our current ruler. We're going to head up to Louisiana. Or rather, Galveston Bay. We're going to focus on these guys instead. It's like, it's good. 174, I mean, it's good. But, clearly, with 4,700 troops, I think we can do a little bit more. Just by putting ourselves in charge of the center. Yeah, this is this is gonna be better. While we have this leader, if we didn't have this leader, it's probably better to do it the other way. Let's go for these two towns and then head home. Our new wife is pregnant, who is also strong, so we're really hopeful. Our, uh, our firstborn was not strong. He's con conscien consci con conscientious. I know how to say that word, I promise. When you have this leader, it's just too good. God general. I bet we have, like, one of the highest. Search all. All characters marshal. Jeez, there's someone out there who's 34. 34 Marshall score. Well, we're up there. I mean, where, where are we? We're down there. I mean, we're 24. It's super pretty good, okay? I'm gonna ask for your opinion. Everybody stood down. You're good. Okay, we'll wait for a little while. We got 800 ducats. We don't need the the money for anything, so let's start building things. Let's build the uh, Machatero training ground, maybe. Uh, let's start reverse order. I want to get the castle shipyards up and running. I want to get any any uh, 
pounds available that we can get. And then beyond that, in Fort George, we'll make the barracks. Okay, cool. Um, I'm going to take a break here. I'll see you again in the next episode. Thank you for watching, everyone. See you soon.